Yes, it is nice to be right. I mean, occasionally I'm wrong. These are rare instances that are almost hard to track. Anywho, Cam Newton, according to a story, may have to accept backup role to remain in the NFL. Story today, the Redskins are interested in Jameis Winston. Not Cam. Bears, not Cam. Raiders, not Cam. Colts, not Cam. Chargers, not Cam. Where Cullen was right. Um, It's Carmelo Anthony. I've often compared Cam Newton to Westbrook. But it's becoming Carmelo Anthony. No self-awareness. Refused to adapt to the new three-point league. Semi-committed. Melo was never in great shape. Writing off that great reputation in college. And his age poorly. Welcome to Carmelo Anthony. Welcome to Cam Newton. I mean, that was always the knock on Carmelo. I remember talking to George Carl once, and he's like, eh, he's never in great shape. He never was. He was kind of committed. If you're not in great shape as a pro athlete, you're not totally committed. You know, Melo always kind of lacks self-awareness. Cam lacks it. Cam's distracted, kind of committed. Um, you know, he's tough. He plays through pain. I, I give him credit for that, and he had one great season. But I never, I always said, what's the market for Cam? What's the market? Inaccurate, 59% completion percentage. Take away one great year, and his passer rating is like 85. I mean, there's been a lot of receivers in the NFL that have had one great year. We don't call them great receivers. There have been running backs who have had a great season. We don't call them great running backs. Cam Newton's 500 since his MVP year. He's an average quarterback who had a great year. Well, he runs around. Not even great at that anymore. He's certainly not Lamar. He's not Russell Wilson. He's not Kyler Murray. And a lot of guys running around. I don't think he's today. He runs around like Carson Wentz. It's good. It's not the best. So, and Cam's cheap too. If Cam can't get a job now, I mean, Brady's expensive. New England wanted him. Tampa wanted him. The Chargers wanted him. And I believe the Colts wanted him. And Tom was expensive and old. Cam is young and cheap. No takers. He, you know, remember when Nolan Norwicky was the uh, scout, the draft guy? And he came out, he's got a draft book, and he said, Cam wants to be a star as much as a quarterback. And everybody was like, oh, this guy, blah, blah, blah. He's right. I mean, Cam is kind of committed. Uh, there's no market for him. There's no market. Um, and there's not a market for everybody. There's good player. Jadavian Clowney is a good player. We'll find a spot. But there's not a huge market for him. And, you know, other players, you know, I, I contend OBJ uh, has a fairly small market, but the teams that would use OBJ, Philadelphia, New England, could really be a good fit. But, you know, just because you're talented doesn't mean the market's big. What is your maintenance? What is your physical? You know, OBJ's been banged up a lot. Cam's been banged up a lot. Carmelo had been not in great shape. You know, the once you get on the market, not everybody ages the same. Brady's aged brilliantly. Big Ben and Cam have not. Big Ben's not known as a guy that's totally committed in the offseason. Brady is. Ben's not aging as well. I still contend Big Ben will never be as good as he was the last time we saw him play. I don't think he's going to recover from his injury. So there's there's no market for Cam. And we're getting to a point after this draft, Cincinnati will have their quarterback. Miami will have their quarterback. The Chargers will have their quarterback. I think Indianapolis, if he's available, may draft Jordan Love. They'll have their quarterback. You'll be down in New England doesn't have a quarterback. I mean, you're running out of teams that don't have a quarterback. I mean, I was, I was thinking this morning. After this draft, how many teams won't have their quarterback? New England, Jacksonville, and the Bears have Trubisky and Nick Foles. Neither one's going to be around in five years. So after this draft, next year we have two superstar college quarterbacks. So two of those teams will probably solve that issue. So there's no market for him. Hi, everybody. Thanks for watching. Subscribe here to get the latest from the show. Also, be sure to check out more of the best clips from The Herd or go watch a few segments from other shows on FS1.